everyone and welcome to another video. Today's video I'm going to be filming my TBR for the month of December. December is the last month running up into the end of the year, just in case you didn't know. And that means I've got to cram in as much books as I can to kind of bump up my final reading goal for the year. Now I already have surpassed my goal which I set for this year which was 100 books but I won't be beating my goal which I set last year and beat last year only because of the publishing job and it, there's a lot of work to do in running a publishing company but saying that I have got loads of books I'm going to be reading this month which I cannot wait to share with you so let's just kick in. First off honourable mention is my Read With Ben book pick of the month and the book which um, the series that we are reading with Read With Ben and for those who don't know Read With Ben is a read long which I host every month sometimes we read a series sometimes we read one book it really depends it's really good fun um, this month we're reading a series and we're reading The Whispers of the Fallen the Gathering of Shadows and The Whispers of the Fallen Rebellion by J.D. Neto. This is an epic fantasy series. It has demons, it has the creator in, it has Lucifer in. It's all about what if Lucifer's secrets were found in his diary. And it is in this and it's fantastic. It opens up this whole new, very unique world. It's got that kind of Lord of the Rings-esque feel. Um, Lord of the Rings meets angels and demons, basically. It's super good and I can't wait to carry on reading this with you all this month. I'm going to be reading a book which is being released on the 15th of December, I believe. 15th or 14th. I will leave the link down below for the Goodreads for you to check it out. But that is Broken Dolls by Tyrolin Puxity. I think I said that completely wrong. But I've actually read this book already. I read this book, um, at, well, this is now with, at the end of the month. So I read it at the beginning of the month. And it's ridiculously unique. It's almost like a Doctor Who episode. It's about these dolls that used to be humans but are dolls and they can't remember their past life. But things are going wrong, some of the dolls that are being made have memories from the past and it's all like why are they dolls, why are they there, what's going on in this world, apparently there's this like people are dying in the real world um, and these dolls are like why is there this illness that's killing like a lot of people if they have certain blood type, it's just really really fun, it's a really quick read and I read it in one sitting whilst I sat at a restaurant just chilling and it was really good. But it's not wrap up, it's TBR so I'll be reading it but I've already read it, we always had this conversation, stay up there, what are you doing? Another novel I'll be reading is Exist Here by Jennifer Cray, Cray Daniels. I'm really excited about this. I believe this is a bit of a sci-fi novel. Now, it's about people that are put into different, like, categories. Um, there's, and I'm really, really excited about this. I'm really excited about this read to the point where I actually might start this today. Um, Jennifer Crazy Daniels has written this novel and I'm really, really excited about it. Exist. I'm, I, I book, I've shown it in my book haul recently and a lot of you were like, well that sounds really interesting. So I'm going to leave the Goodreads page down below for you to check out this book and to see if you might find it really interesting as well. But I'm really intrigued by it. I, it's, uh, will you join the fight? They call us benders. I prefer the term extraordinary. I'm excited. I'm going to be reading this book here. It's called Creature by a Creature Series by Nelly Cab. And I am really, really excited about this. I, right, listen to this quote somebody said. Nelly Cab's Creature is a, sh is sure to appeal to fans of Stephanie Meyer's Twilight and other young adult paranormal romances, but this, uh, but it's certainly better written than most. I'm really excited about this. I think the cover's gorgeous and I'm really, really excited to get into this one and find out what it's about. Also, something that I really want to show you is the cover, the, well, there's loads of things in here, like loads of really awesome, cool, different, like, interior designs, but look at this first page. Look at that eye. How cool is that? I'm really excited about this. This is a paranormal romance which I really cannot wait to read. It's gonna be mind-blowing. I'm gonna be reading a Norse God book as well, and this one is called Elska by Book One in the Elska Saga by St. Bende, um, and I'm really excited about this one. Um, this series has got like Norse gods in, like the whole kind of Viking-esque feel to it. I'm really excited, but it's a paranormal romance and I'm ready for a bit. And I think it's a bit new NA as well, which I'm really, really excited about. I love NA. I'll leave the Goodreads page down below. I'm reading this dystopian read, Talus, by Katharina Constantine. And this is um, a dystopian novel and I believe it has people with special abilities in as well, which I'm really excited about getting into. I'm actually reading this at the moment and it is really, really interesting. The beginning is fantastic. So I'm hoping to mostly read it and get Quite a, quite a way in today, so I will keep you guys posted over on Twitter and Instagram on how I'm doing. Another book I'm reading is Edna Walter's Runes, a rune novel, and I'm really excited about this one. Ancient mythology, it has romance, it's paranormal romance, and I'm really, really, really excited about this one. It kind of enters into this, because this author has written a fantastic, like, lead-on series, and 
I'm really excited about finding out more about this paranormal creatures and these paranormal world. And I love the name Runes. I mean, I'm obsessed with Runes as it is, but yeah, I'm really excited about finding out about Rain and Torin, and it's gonna be fantabulous! And last but not least, I'm reading Broken Forest by Lisa Tilton, and this is book one in the Darth Chronicles. This is the new cover for the series. This is, again, an epic an epic fantasy series which I'm really excited about getting into and it's got eyes on the cover and it's so gorgeous and it's so amazing and I can't wait to read it Mwah. so I will keep you posted again with this one as well I'll be putting videos sporadically up throughout the month for you guys to check out but if you want to look at any of these books I'm gonna leave all the Goodreads pages down below and also my social medias for you to come and check me out if you want to come and chat to me there um, the reason why there might not be as many books on my TBR for this month is because I'm reading loads of submissions from Tomes Publishing so I am very busy but but Ooh, it's all good and I will speak to you again in another video very soon. Bye-bye!